Hey guys, it's Ison here, and I'm here to talk about some more Attack Wing. Um, I came up with a storage solution that I really like. Uh, I decided to get rid of the idea of the whole spray foam thing. It's something I might look at in the future for like a special setup. Like if I have, you know, a fleet I really like using or whatever. But I went with a much simpler idea and I really like it. Um, basically, boom. I got some styrofoam sheets. Uh like these at the craft store and they have I don't know if you can see them there I have the pegs embedded in there um, I'm gonna show you my proof of concept and I'm not done that yet it's just I've started on it and this is how I um, worked out the idea basically this is what the finished products gonna look like well you know on the larger sheet it has the ship um, thing there we go all that good information uh, and the ship pops off there and when it's in the case you can just push it right back on and basically how I did that was uh, twist or uh, zip ties so I took a screwdriver and I widened the hole of the zip tie then I cut this off and then I put the peg through the top like the top bump so the peg went in through here and then I pushed that on the styrofoam and there we go I cut the zip tie off it's really hard to see there we go and I pushed it through till the peg stuck out about that far um I might have to modify that for different ships I kind of put that one at an angle and then I took the part of the twist tie that was left and I looped it and stuck it in so it holds in there securely with no glue or anything now at current, I'm using the pegs from my ships, uh, just one of them. That means my ships are going to be flying pretty low to the ground for a while. But I did find a site um, with someone who makes these custom acrylic pegs. They look really close to the originals. And I'm going to order a pack of those and replace all the pegs in my storage with those so I can get my original pegs back. I'll put a link down uh, for that down below, but as a heads up, I haven't ordered them yet, so I don't know 100% that they're going to work or be, you know, as high quality as they could be. So I'll let you guys know that once I try them out. But yeah, buy at your own risk there. So I've got, I picked up a couple more of these stackers. So I'm going to have two or three trays of these. I'm going to have one tray that has like four, maybe five pegs. So my current fleet can be in that. Um... And I have to put all the chips in here. And then I'm going to just have a couple. So, you know, if I'm going to the game store, I can be like, okay, well, take these with me. Then, for the rest of them, I've got my bigger one. And I'm going to do that as one big old storage thing. And these I can always get a couple more of, should I ever need to expand in the future. So, I'm really excited about this. Um, I'm super happy with the solution. It's very simple. I'm going to... I have to look and see what kind of paints I can use on styrofoam, but I'll probably do it like a just a black top on this. Um, you know, just pop off all the ships, pull out the uh, cardboard, and just paint over it with black so it'll look nice and smooth. But yeah, um, I'm really happy with how they came out. Boom. I mean, it's really nice looking. I have to work on my angling a little more. And super convenient. They don't jostle around in there. They hold really securely. So I don't even have to worry about padding. So... Yeah, that's uh, what I've been going with. Um, I'd love to see other people's solutions for storage. So if you want to leave a link to a video or a picture down below of how you store your stuff, I'd love to see it. I'm always up for new ideas. But um, thanks for watching. And as always, have a, have a great one.